Landmines, as a seemingly rigid weapon, have always played a crucial role in modern warfare. Intelligent advanced landmines can even distinguish target types and choose to attack, while dumb landmines made of metal cans can potentially overturn main battle tanks. Therefore, mine clearance has become an essential and tedious task, leading to the creation of various professional mine clearing vehicles. One of the experts in this field is the British company Limited, which developed the Badger semi-tracked mine clearing vehicle, a very good mine clearing weapon. Like many British Army vehicles, the Badger has a distinctive appearance. It has a double cab at the front, with nearly vertical structures on all sides, armored steel plates, and 56mm thick bulletproof glass for protection. The crew enters and exits through the front middle door of the cab. The bottom of the cab is high above the ground, with a double-layered sloping armor design to reduce the damage to the crew from explosions. It is also equipped with sound insulation materials to some extent, improving comfort. Below the cab is the steering wheel, and the rear is a metal track structure. This design allows the mine-clearing vehicle to have good terrain passing capability, and the metal track can better resist landmine damage. The side of the track is triangular, with the drive wheel located at the upper inside corner of the triangle, which is quite unique, possibly to increase the ground clearance of the vehicle. The vehicle is powered by a 160 horsepower six-cylinder turbocharged diesel engine. Because the vehicle does not pursue speed, the maximum speed is about 20 km per hour. It can cross a trench of 0.5 meters and operate on a 30 degrees slope. The flail type mine clearance device is installed at the rear of the vehicle, with 72 iron chains and the option to install different striking tools such as metal balls, hammers, and iron plates at the top of the chains to deal with different clearance targets and terrain environments. The maximum penetration depth into the ground is 0.5 meters. The mine clearance device rotates at a speed of 300 revolutions per minute, and the dense iron chains can ensure that every piece of ground is whipped twice, ensuring no hidden dangers are left behind. During normal maneuvering, the badger moves forward in the direction of the cab, but when performing mine clearance operations, it reverses. It can clear a 3 meter wide safe zone, with a maximum mine clearance speed of 800 meters per hour. In actual use, a 7.62 mm machine gun may be installed on the top of the cab as a self-defense weapon. The Badger mine clearance vehicle is a very good mine clearance vehicle, used to clear mines or explosives weighing less than 10 kg. It has been provided to more than 10 countries, and the United Nations and some other non-governmental organizations have also adopted it, mainly operating in the Middle East and Africa. It has been spotted in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Syria. The Russian military even received one in Syria in 2019 and displayed it after taking it back. However, in practice, the use of the Badger is quite complicated. Taking France as an example, the country has eight Badger mine clearance teams, each with two Badger vehicles. Each Badger vehicle requires a dedicated trailer and two transport vehicles for long-distance mobility, as well as one armored personnel carrier and two armored vehicles for support.